Hey guys, welcome back to another YouTube video. And oh, why did I say YouTube? Uh, this is just another programming solving tutorial. And in this one, I'm going to be solving this problem. And there isn't actually like you can't do what he wants, which is just to reset all the variables inside. But I'm going to be showing you an example of a way which you can kind of do this with a function. So um, you can't restart an app, uh, but you can just reset all your variables and. Uh, all of your other stuff if you just do it from the beginning so for this one what we're going to do is I'm going to create a new file and I'd recommend doing this with all your projects this file will be called uh, data management and basically inside of it you can store all of your global variables which you want to access across the app and you also can store all your functions so uh, store global variables and here you can store global functions. And um, I'm just going to, for this example, create. Uh, we'll have to create vars, and we'll have var name equals. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, so var name equals name, and then we'll have. Uh, what's going on here? Okay, that was weird. Anyway, now we can have our age, which is going to be uh, let's have ten. So now let's just say you're doing something and you change all those variables. So you just change variables here. Now you can change them anywhere since they're global variables. And now what I would do to reset this is to create a new global function called uh, reset variables and inside of here what we can do is we can just set the name back to name and we can set the age back to age oh, back to the original age so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to print name and we can print age uh, now I'm going to change age to like we'll change it to 21 print age and here and then after this I'll just reset uh, variables and this will just reset everything back to the original and then it'll end up printing um, the original name so I can't really run this right now but oh wait what's this issue uh, uh, wait let me build this to see if that still happens okay there we go so it's just a glitch okay so build succeeded and now I can't really run this because I haven't opened the simulator in the background but I can just write what would it print so it will print name here uh, and then here it will print 10 down here it will print 21 reset variables if we copy and paste this and now it would print a uh, name because it's the same and it will just print age again which is 10 because we reset it back to the original so yeah, you can just, if you store all your variables in a data management uh, file from the beginning, then you can create this uh, function. Every time you add a new variable, you can add a fun add it to this function, which resets it. So yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in a future tutorial. Bye!